Traralgon is a city located in the east of the La Trobe Valley in the Gippsland region of Victoria, Australia. The urban population of Traralgon at the 2011 census was 24,590. It is the largest and fastest growing city in the Greater La Trobe Valley urban area which has a population of more than 75,000 and is administered by the city of La Trobe. The origin of the name Traralgon is uncertain. It is popularly believed to be derived from words from the Guna language, Tara meaning river and Algon meaning little fish. However, these words are not reflected in modern linguists' knowledge of the Guna language, where, for example, the word for river is one one or worn worn. History The Gippsland region was originally inhabited by the indigenous Kunai people for a period in excess of 2,000 years. The area around Traralgon was first settled by Europeans in the 1840s soon after being explored by Count Paul Strzelecki on his return from the snowy mountains where he named Australia's highest peak, Mount Kosciuszko. Due to the La Trobe Valley having relatively high rainfall, the land is very fertile, and farming was quickly established. As with much of central and western Gippsland, this was mainly dairy farming. The township was established in the early 1860s, the first post office opening on January 1, 1861. In 1877 the railway line from Melbourne was completed with a railway station at Traralgon giving the town a major economic boost. Traralgon was part of the area administered by the Rosa Jail Roads Board, before the Shire of Traralgon was established in 1879. In the latter part of the 19th century the Shire grew strongly. It was not until the 1930s however that Traralgon began to move away from a farming-based economy. In 1936 Australian paper manufacturers established a paper mill at Maryvale, around 8 kilometres, 5 miles, from Traralgon. Queen Elizabeth II and Prince Philip, Duke of Edinburgh visited on March 3, 1954. The president of the Shire of Traralgon, C.R. Klim Little met and welcomed the Queen, who was flown by the RAF from Sale. She returned to Melbourne by train. In 1960 Traralgon's most famous son Sir McFarlane Burnett jointly won the Nobel Prize for Physiology and Medicine. In 1961 Traralgon formed its own borough. The borough of Traralgon following a decade of lobbying to separate the urban areas of Traralgon from the Shire. Traralgon was proclaimed a city in 1964. The old town hall and mechanics institute was finally demolished in 1973. Further development resulted from the expansion of the power generation industry following World War II particularly through the now-defunct SEC. This included large expansions at Yallern and Hazelwood power stations and the construction of the massive Loyang power station in the 1970s and 1980s. The first Loyang power station was completed in 1985. An Australian Securities and Investments Commission, ASIC, Information Processing Centre was established in the early 1990s, at the time employing around 400 people. The city of Traralgon and Shire of Traralgon continued a separate existence until they were amalgamated into the Shire of La Trobe in 1994. Completion of the Loyang Power Stations, extensive voluntary departures vague from the electricity industry and privatization of the Victorian electricity industry in the early 1990s had devastating effects on the economy of the La Trobe Valley. Traralgon, with a more diversified economy, 
suffered to a lesser extent than the neighboring towns of Morwell and Mo both of which relied almost exclusively on the power stations for their livelihood. Traralgon grew strongly in the mid-2000s, with a figure of 2.7% making it the largest and fastest growing city in the La Trobe Valley. Geography Traralgon is situated on expansive flat land in the Traralgon Creek Valley catchment between the Great Dividing Range in the north and the Strzelecki Ranges in the south. The Traralgon Creek runs through the city's center and its green belt separates its eastern and western suburban areas. The urban area is also hemmed between large open cut mines to the northwest and southeast. Urban structure Traralgon is part of the La Trobe Valley Tri-City Urban Area, a small area of industry and agricultural land separates it from neighboring Morwell. Traralgon together with adjacent Morwell forms an urban area with an estimated population of 40,851 as of June 2014. In recent years the population has grown from 36,829 in June 2004 reaching a peak of 40,911 in 2012 and declining since. 8. Greater Traralgon includes localities such as Traralgon, the suburb of Traralgon East and the relatively sparsely populated satellite localities of Hazelwood and Traralgon South to the south, and Tyres and Glengarry to the north. The Traralgon Central Business District is centered around Seymour and Franklin Streets and includes an indoor shopping mall, Stockland Traralgon. However commercial and light industry sprawl along most of the eastern stretch of the Princess Highway. Notable heritage buildings include the post office and courthouse erected in 1886 and Ryan's Hotel erected in 1914, both in Franklin Street. Economy The economy is primarily driven by primary industry, natural resources and secondary industry including coal mining processing and fossil fuel power generation 9 for the national electricity market along with electricity production traralgon benefits from the mining for royal and national gas in the nearby bass strait fields a significant forestry industry operates including logging of both plantation and natural forest timber the largest paper mill in Australia is located nearby in Maryvale and provides local employment for over 2,000 people. The local agriculture industry is involved in the production of wool and dairy products, as well as vegetable growing. The tertiary sector of the economy is also important for employment with major government administration offices for the Australian Securities and Investments Commission. ESIC, and health services. Schools, Traralgon features a number of primary and secondary schools, including state, Catholic and independent schools. The local primary schools include Gray Street Primary School, formerly Traralgon Primary School, Kosciuszko Street Primary School, Lydiard Road Primary School, Stockdale Road Primary School, St. Michael's Primary School, St. Gabriel's Primary School, Flinders Christian Community College, FCCC, and St. Paul's Anglican Grammar School. Flinders Christian Community College and St. Paul's Anglican Grammar School are also secondary schools. In addition Traralgon has the La Trobe Special Developmental School catering for students from 5 to 18 years of age with an intellectual disability. The local government's secondary school, Traralgon College, has two campuses, the junior campus, years 7 to 9, located on Lydiard Road in Traralgon's East, with the senior campus, years 10 to 12 on Gray Street in Traralgon's West. There is also a Catholic secondary school, Lavla Catholic College. Lavla has two campuses in Traralgon's West End, 
and a third campus in Nubaro, Mo. The junior campus, St. Paul's, neighbors Traralgon College's senior campus on Gray Street The senior campus, Kildare, is located in Kosciuszko Street Flinders Christian Community College, FCCC, on Lydiard Road is a P-12 school. A number of Traralgon families also send their children to the three independent Anglican grammar schools in the region, two of which are about 40 minutes' drive from Traralgon, St. Paul's Anglican Grammar School, which has a campus in Traralgon as well as Waragal, or Gippsland Grammar School in Sale. Culture Sport Australian Rules Football is popular. The are two senior clubs. The Traralgon Maroons, which briefly competed in the Victorian Football League between 1996 to 1997, currently competing in the Gippsland Football League and Traralgon Tires United competing in the North Gippsland Football League. There is also a Junior League, Traralgon and District Junior Football League, with most games played from the West End Sporting Complex. Cricket is also popular, with a local league, the Traralgon and District Cricket Association, TDCA, operating. Soccer is popular with two senior clubs in the Gippsland Soccer League GSL, Traralgon Olympians and Traralgon City. There is a local basketball league, the Traralgon Basketball Association with a stadium at the Traralgon Sports Complex. The local baseball team is the Traralgon. Traralgon has a horse racing club, the La Trobe Valley Racing Club, which schedules two race meetings a year including the cup meeting in December. The Traralgon Greyhound Racing Club holds regular meetings at Glenview Park. Golfers play at the course of the Traralgon Golf Club on the Princess Highway. The Traralgon Harriers are a running club that runs 5 or 6 kilometers races every Thursday night and also organize Victoria's oldest marathon, the Traralgon Marathon, held every June. The La Trobe Valley Cycling Club hold road and track racing events on most weeks throughout the year. Traralgon Pistol Club and Traralgon Small Bore Rifle Club also located in the town with a healthy membership at both clubs. Entertainment The Entertainment Precinct which spans K, Gray and Franklin Streets attracts people from surrounding towns to several nightclubs, bars and restaurants located there. Local Media Newspapers the twice-weekly La Trobe Valley Express newspaper is delivered to all homes on Monday and Thursday nights, in Traralgon, Morwell and Mo. Smaller, weekly papers The Traralgon Journal, Mo and Narican News, along with the Morwell and Churchill Advertiser are delivered to all homes on Monday nights with the La Trobe Valley Express. The Traralgon Record newspaper has been digitized from 1886 to 1932 as part of the Australian Newspapers Digitization Program. Melbourne newspapers such as The Weekly Times, The Age and The Herald Sun and national newspapers like The Australian and The Australian Financial Review are also available. Television The three main commercial television networks, 7, 9 and 10, are all rebroadcast in the La Trobe Valley by their regional affiliates, Prime 7, 7, Wind Television, 9, and Southern Cross 10, 10. The area was the first in Australia to receive its own regional television station, GLV 10 Gippsland, now Southern Cross 10, when it launched on December 9, 1961. When Gippsland provides a 30-minute local news bulletin on weeknights and Southern Cross 10 airs short local news updates on weekdays. All three commercial stations also carry local advertising. Most Melbourne channels, 7, 9 and 10, can also be received in analog and more clearly in digital in Traralgon with a suitable rooftop antenna.
new channels broadcast by the commercial networks in addition to the ones listed above are available on the digital service called Freeview, Australia, to viewers in Traralgon and the Gippsland, Lot Robe Valley region. These channels include 1 HD, 11, 7 2, 7 Mate, Jim and Go. Both national public broadcasters, the Australian Broadcasting Corporation, including channels ABC 1, ABC 2, ABC 3 and ABC News 24, and special broadcasting service, including SBS 1 and SBS 2, are also broadcast to the Latrobe Valley. Subscription television service formerly Austar, now Foxtel, circa 2014, is available via satellite. Radio There are two radio stations with studios located in Trer Algon, TRFM and Gold 1242, both owned by Ace Radio. The FM station is broadcast along with the television channels from Mount Tassie while Gold 1242 is broadcast from an AM transmitter near Sale. Waragle Radio Stations Star FM and 3GG also service this region. Most Australian Broadcasting Corporation stations are rebroadcast locally and available in Trer Algon, along with 774 ABC Melbourne which is able to be received directly from Melbourne. Transport, road transport and the motor vehicle is the main form of transport. The Prince's Highway runs through the city and close to the CBD which received heavy regional traffic, although a Traralgon bypass road is undergoing planning. The Highland Highway also originates at Traralgon. Rail transport includes both passenger rail and freight rail. The city's only station is Traralgon Railway Station which is on the Orb Austral Rail Line. Both the Traralgon V, Line Rail Service and the Berenstale V, Line Rail Service stop there. Traralgon is currently the terminus for Velocity Trains with a two-way hourly service. Travel time to Flinders Street Station ranges at approximately 109 minutes during peak travel times. Victoria's Electronic Ticketing System, Mikey was implemented on rail services between Traralgon and Melbourne on July 8, 2013. La Trobe Valley Buslines provides local services around Traralgon and other cities in the La Trobe Valley. La Trobe Valley Airport is located close to Traralgon in nearby Morwell and provides general aviation. Traralgon has a minimal bicycle infrastructure with few segregated cycle facilities. An exception is the 63-kilometer-long Gippsland Plains Rail Trail which connects Traralgon to Stratford via Calwar, Hayfield, Tinimba and Mafra.